Hello everyone and welcome to Rationable once again. Today I wanted to do a quick episode to tell you a little bit about some of the podcasts that have been most informative and helpful for me along the way and on my journey as a science communicator and as a skeptic, so to speak. And if you want to check out stuff that has influenced me, then you got to check this list out. So let's get into it right now. First off is the Skeptic's Guide to the Universe. Now this is hosted by Stephen Novella along with his brothers Jay and Bob Novella and uh, with their friend Evan Bernstein and Cara Santa Maria, who is an accomplished science communicator in her own right. Now I had the privilege of uh, attending a workshop by Cara which was in 2018 and that was brilliant. That really got me motivated to start up everything that's been going on on Rationable. So uh, you definitely should check this out. They cover all the latest news items with science and pseudoscience and helping you understand all the information that's out there right now and really break it down to help you suss out why it's true or not and how to help you separate fact from fake. Uh, the second one, which was most influential, was Skeptoid, which is hosted by Brian Dunning. And actually, I've... I initially modeled the Rationable podcast based on that, so I would write an episode and then I'd uh, basically record it to make it like about a 15-20 minute long mini podcast episode, which would just be a huge deep dive into a lot of these very important issues that, you know, that were being talked about. The difference is that Skeptoid is more of a they work on issues which are kind of permanent like these are either ghost stories or alien abduction stories or things like that which have basically crossed you know over the years they're not just generally trending topics these are topics that are being discussed continuously and have been a central part of some conspiracy theories or some bad ideas or something of that sort even astrology alternative medicine alien abductions as i said before and a whole bunch of other stuff like cryptozoology it just it goes on and it's brilliant very fascinating um episodes especially he talks about some things like you know ghost ships and you know spooky incidences and urban legends that have been come down and haven't really been you know they've, they've become part of global culture to a great extent but you know, we don't really, we always think that wonder if it's true or not. Well, he really gets into the issues there. Uh, the third is The Skeptic Zone, which is hosted by Richard Saunders uh, from Australia. And he's got a whole host of guests who come in on every episode. I've had the privilege of being a guest more than once. And he has been uh, a guest on the Rationable YouTube channel as well, where I've interviewed him and all he does and why he does it all. So it's another fantastic uh, podcast. This is a bit more long form than Skeptoid. It's about an hour, hour and a half, hour and 45 minutes sometimes. And they basically talk about everything about psychics to ghosts to pseudoscientific ideas and fortune tellers and you know healers and all sorts of other things so they deal with a tremendous range of topics and they get guests from all over the world from us and canada to europe and the uk to australia itself and of course me from india so they've got a it's a fantastic show really covers a lot of bases very dense in in information um, they've also had Leonard Chamiel on for a couple of times. I had the pleasure of interviewing Leonard myself a few week, uh, months ago, actually. Uh, so you'll be able to find that also. All these interviews that I'm talking about that I've done with them, I'll put the links in the description. Uh, another great one is Science Versus, which is um, a really fun, it's a relatively short, quick episode, but it's really, it's really well produced. They've got lots of, I mean, the script is fantastic. They've got puns and 
jokes of all sorts, making very, very heavy topics, very light and easy to consume. They've got lots of interviews going on. There's a lot of investigative journalism that goes into that and it is fantastic. They talk about all sorts of things, all about, and they did multiple deep dives into COVID when it was starting last year and some other fascinating stories, which you've got to check out if you can. And finally, number five is Star Talk Radio with Neil deGrasse Tyson, our favorite neighborhood, you can call it that, astrophysicist, our personal astrophysicist, as he likes to call himself. And he does this really nice gelling with, I mean, he brings science and he kind of connects it with pop culture by interviewing a lot of pop culture heroes, like actors, musicians, comedians, um, and really uh, talking about their, what he likes to call their geek underbelly. And he usually teams up with a comedian who cracks jokes about the science that he's talking. So that also kind of really lightens things up and makes it very interesting and fun to listen to. So you should definitely give that a shot. They've got a lot of these cosmic queries and stuff like that where they answer listeners' questions about astrophysics and all sorts of like almost every aspect of science that you can possibly think about. So you should definitely check out these. So just to recap, The Skeptic's Guide to the Universe, Skeptoid, The Skeptic Zone, Science Versus, and Star Talk Radio. So guys, check out these podcasts, add them to your playlists, listen to them as frequently as you possibly can. Trust me, they will add a lot to your life and the way you think as they have helped me. Of course, I'll be adding to this list as we go forward. So if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel, like this video if you liked it, and share it with friends who are also looking for new podcasts to check out. Thanks, and I'll see you in the next episode.